Finding a good password manager has become much more complicated in 2023. And why? Well, it could be related to the fact that almost all password managers are running into some sort of scandal or issue. LastPass, they're the biggest player, which recently had to take ownership of leaked password vaults. You know, the one thing that you paid them to protect? Yeah. Now, users of most major password managers seem to all have the same thought. Time to abandon ship. So, knowing that most password managers are, well, awful, who do you trust? And how do you know that you can trust them? Well, to help you answer that question, we've got a list of the best password managers in 2023. These password managers aren't known to have a history of leaks and participate in critical third-party audits in the interest of transparency. So we've got a list of five password managers that we've found to meet and even exceed those requirements. And in this video, we plan on rating them based on security, features, pricing, and ease of use. The password managers we plan on talking about include RoboForm, 1Password, Bitwarden, NordPass, and Zoho Vault. Now, our findings show that these security tools meet or exceed our security requirements. Knowing this, if you prefer, you can go and skip to the part where you just go and click the discount link in our video description below, where you can find up to 50% discounts of our favorites. And then again, if you want to see why we think these security tools are so good, well, we don't blame you. So let's get started with the number one priority, <laughs> security. The ultimate test of security comes in the real world. So that real world brings us to a simple question. Do they have any leaks? Well, across the board, we found the same answer to all five products. No. Hey. <laughs> but that's obvious because this is a best of list. So what about something a bit meatier? Four of these managers use the gold standard of end-to-end -end encryption, AES-256, which, if you've paid attention to our VPN reviews, is the best encryption security. NordPass, however, relies on XChaCha20, which is a newer encryption protocol. ChaCha is more secure against some security aspects, but AES has been around for longer, making them similar. The companies support zero-knowledge encryption meaning that they don't log your password data. Even if someone internally were to take the servers, none of the companies could take your password data. And this is similar to the no logging policy that VPNs take. All of these password managers also support multi-factor authentication or MFA. The companies uniformly support third-party tools for authentication. Uh, for example, YubiKey is a robust authentication tool separate from your phone. And this tool is supported across these platforms. <laughs> Man, these password managers are pretty hardcore, let me tell you. Ooh! Hardcore parkour. Oh, okay, well maybe not that hardcore. Now, RoboForm also offers you to turn off online sync to use your local storage instead. Now, this means that you can use RoboForm in offline mode, yes. NordPass, on the other hand, doesn't even autofill if you're not connected to the internet. Now, you do still have to authenticate and unlock your vault with your master password, even if you turn off autosync in RoboForm, but it still does the job. And that's good enough for us. Bitwarden also offers you the ability to host on your own server if you are so inclined, but yeah, it's a bit of a task. And we only recommend this to our more pro viewers. Anytime you store your passwords elsewhere, especially with a company, they are at risk. As proven by LastPass, these big, juicy password management companies are a tempting target for people who want your vaults. Now, by offering the ability to turn off sync, which RoboForm does, you put greater security control in the hands of the user. Both 1Password and Zoho Fault offer similar services, letting you store your passwords on local services. But these features are often limited to business tiers, meaning you'll have to rely on cloud servers. Bitwarden has impressive security, but only supports cloud-based password storage. And this brings us to our final tally of the most secure password manager. Roboform is number one. NordPass is barely at number two. One password is number three. Zoho Vault is number four. And Bitwarden is number five. Next, let's take a closer look at the features of each product. 
The good news is that these password managers have the basics down. They include browser-based apps that autofill passwords for you. I mean, that way you don't have to memorize everything. It's just, it's just like Sonic the Hedgehog says. Hey, you don't have enough memory in the memory card. Is your memory card set correctly? Only replace memory card with brain, and you get the idea. Now, all of these password managers also help you to generate strong passwords. That way, the individual passwords on your accounts remain secure, as having a strong password is still very important. When these passwords are compromised, these password managers offer various notification systems to tell you when to change them. When your password manager notifies you of the need, well, you can easily access your account and go and change things, and then have your manager change with them. Now, if you want to find these passwords, you can also use built-in search engines to find specific passwords. For example, if you want to find your Google password, you could just search Google in any of these managers. You can also easily import existing passwords from a CSV file or other password managers using any platform on this list. So if you need to move from a recently dishonored password manager, you can do that. Not that I'm pointing any fingers or anything. <clears throat> Another vital feature across these password sharing platforms is emergency access. Now this lets you designate a trusted person to access your passwords in case you cannot. So if you end up indisposed for some reason, your designated trusted person can still get access to your accounts on your behalf. Now to dig into some individual features. Roboform's most powerful feature is their one-click login. This might seem simple at the surface level, but that sort of convenience isn't exactly easy to execute. In fact, other password managers such as 1Password, NordPass, and Bitwarden don't even offer it as a feature. Isn't saving time and being secure the entire point? The company also supports storing online form data, credit cards, notes, bookmarks, and contacts. NordPass also allows access to passwords online and stores the same information minus the bookmarks. The autofilling feature applies to personal information like your name, your email, and phone number, similar to Google Chrome's autofill. Zoho Vault also offers unique tool-based integrations, and you can connect your Vault with products like Microsoft Office 365, Google Drive, Dropbox, and a wide range of other apps, including its own library of business-based apps. Zoho, however, is more geared towards businesses, so their individual plans feel a little lackluster. Bitwarden's unique feature is Bitwarden Send, which lets you securely send files and other information through its unique messaging platform. This is an alternative to Telegram or WhatsApp without automatic deletion features built into these messages. 1Password has, well, nothing unique but has put more work into its dark web monitoring feature, Watchtower. Watchtower is a dedicated space informing you if your data is compromised. So based on the most feature-rich tool, our number one pick has to be Roboform at number one, NordPass at number two, Zoho Vault at number three, Bitwarden at number four, and 1Password at number five. Now because of all these features, I mean, they're all situationally good, your opinion might differ. Our logic is that we can find more overall usefulness in offline access. Now let's go and take a look at our last section, pricing. Pricing is a bit different because ultimately it's up to you how much you want to spend. The only disappointment is that you, well, you can't really haggle over the price. Oh, uh, 20 shekels. Right. What? There you are. Wait a minute. Oh, well, we're, we're supposed to haggle. Hey, look, you can pretend to haggle up to 50% off by going to check out our discount link in the description below. We hope that they help you ease the burden. So based on our findings, the best pricing overall goes to Bitwarden. You see, Bitwarden wins because it starts for free on unlimited devices and passwords, but that pricing level doesn't come with MFA, which is a huge security risk. If you're willing to pay $10 a year, you can get this 2FA, but the cost effectiveness of this program drops off for families as it shoots to $40 a year if you want up to six users. Zoho Vault offers the second best cost-effective plan for individuals at just under $1 per month, 
It also has a free version, but you can only store your passwords on just one device. Like other platforms, the family plan isn't as cheap. It's about $4.50 per month, which limits you up to five users. So it isn't as cost effective for families. Roboform offers the next pricing level at $23.88 for individuals for a year and $47.75 for up to five family members per year. Now you can go and pay for multiple years to get deeper discounts, which other providers don't, well, provide. NordPass is more expensive than Roboform, costing per individual $35.88 and per family $71.88. They do also offer more discounts if you pay for multiple years up front. 1Password is the least cost-effective option on the list, costing $2.99 per month for individuals and $4.99 per month for up to five family members. Of course, these prices don't apply to business plans, and you might find some cheaper results in our video's description. So, ultimately, our pricing comparison shows that the cheapest potential products are... Number 1. Bitwarden Number two, Zoho Vault. Number three, Roboform. Number four, NordPass. And one password at number five. While Bitwarden is number one on cost, remember that their free plan doesn't include MFA. Multi-factor authentication has become a staple of modern security, so we cannot recommend their free plan. All right, so let's take a look at our last area of focus, ease of use. The number one focus of ease of use is the autosync feature, available across all five password managers. Whether that autosync feature is useful depends on whether they support your platform. All platforms on this list support Google Chrome, Edge, Windows, iOS, and Android apps. Zoho Vault has the most widespread browser support, covering everything from Chrome to Vivaldi. Both Zoho and Bitwardens also have deep Linux support. They even go as far as to support those who use CLI, or command line interface, making them ideal for those who prefer this over GUIs, or GUIs, which is all two of you. Hey, but we see you and we still love you. Oh yeah. But there is a drawback to having widespread support for everything, being stretched. Bitwarden and Zoho both have weaker interfaces, mainly because they support more products, which is the case with Zoho or they support too many platforms, which is the case with Bitwarden. The remaining three, 1Password, NordPass, and Roboform, focus more on the browser extensions than mobile apps, which makes them run a bit faster, in our experience. Now, what we don't enjoy is the fact that NordPass requires downloading their desktop app on Windows in order for their extension to work. Now, you do get extra features this way, but an extra app eating our bandwidth? Well, it isn't exactly our cup of tea, you know? Other password managers like 1Password and Roboform don't have this as a requirement, which gives them an edge, in our opinion. All of these password managers also accept sorting through folders. Now, this lets you organize your password by category, which does make them easier to find. And finally, they all support desktop applications, not just browser-based extensions. So, if you want to store app passwords, you can do that, which is a mistake that Dashlane made. Now, in addition to the above, Roboform offers the most support options, including live chat and phone callbacks. Sure, the Windows editor is a bit dated, but their one-click login and modern extension will save you a ton of time and clicks. And that's what matters most, yeah? So when we tally up all the scores, the best password manager of 2023 is... Roboform! Now, it might not be the cheapest password manager on this list, but it is easily the most useful. It has all the helpful features that you would expect from password managers and high security standards. But what put it over the top was the ability to access your passwords and store them offline, along with the ability to log in quickly with the fewest clicks. This gives you more control over keeping the most secure passwords. Your favorite password manager might change depending on your priorities. If you're looking for more of a business-oriented solution, well, Zoho Vault might serve you better. You might also have a tight budget pointing you towards Bitwarden. Both NordPass and 1Password are also companies worth your trust with powerful features. Still, focusing on customer-centric practices and flexibility gives Roboform the best chance to be beneficial to more people. Now for a quick honorable mention, Dashlane. 
why wasn't Dashlane on this list of the best password managers for 2023? Well, it comes down to a couple of factors for us. First, Dashlane discontinued support for its desktop application earlier this year. Now, this makes it tricky to store app-based passwords and impossible to online access. And this isn't surprising, as many password managers focus more on their app and browser extensions. Dashlane offers poorer user experience and is a little too expensive for what it offers. It also lacks the ability to sync with your own storage and doesn't have a true one-click login function either. Despite this, they have the widespread trust of many companies. But for the purpose of this review, we can't consider them as one of the best options that you can find. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. We would also appreciate your support by liking and sharing the video with all your friends. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.